So the next reaction that we're going to look at is a single replacement reaction. The silver metal that started in the test tube was zinc, and then the clear liquid that was added to it was a pretty concentrated hydrochloric acid solution, HCl. Notice when we added the HCl to the zinc metal, we got indicators of a chemical reaction, bubbles being given off. If you would touch the side of that test tube as well, you'd find out that that test tube is going to be hot. So we're going to let this go for a little bit and watch the bubbles. All the while, gas being produced means a chemical reaction is occurring. A certain gas is being produced, and that's hydrogen gas. Now, hydrogen gas is a pretty flammable gas. So what's going to happen here eventually, you can watch, is that uh, one of the people in the lab group is going to light a wood splint. It's just a little piece of wood. You're going to use the Bunsen burner in the back to get it on fire. And then we're going to bring the burning wood splint over the top of the test tube and you can hear what happens when that hydrogen gas is ignited. This is a test for hydrogen gas. We have fire going in. So you hear that popping noise, that's a test for hydrogen gas. Now notice it's still bubbling, so there's more hydrogen gas being produced, so we can do the test again. Like a bird. There we go. Wait, which one was that? Yeah. We need light nitrate. So pretty. 